तुलसी सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरीय गोष्ठीपति वंदे गुरुपद द्वंदम भक्तबिंद समीचैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंद सहोदित श्रीनंदनंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंदवन मनोहर वाछाकुर्वश कृपा सिंधु भवच पति पावने वैष्णवभ्यो नमो नम मुकोति वाचाल पंगुम लंघयति गिरी यत्तमहंग वंदे परमाधव बृंदा वै तुलसीदेव वै पिया वै केशव सृष्णक्तिपदे देवी सत्यवत नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नर चरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मधीर संकीर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीय पत्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरु भक्ति युक्त भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदर धेय सदा परिभवनमीष्टदूहम तीर्थास्पद शिव विरचनुत शरण्यम वेतातिहम पनुतपाल भवादीपूत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरणिंद यत्दल्लवन खचंदमि छटाय विस्फुजीत कबूदूषु आदर्श पूर्णागर सागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामय कदा कृपाकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनिंद श्रीअदगदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनिंद श्रीअदगदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनुका बुदात संकीर्तन कवितर कमलायताश विशाबरो दिजबरो जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणावतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे नमा गंगे तव पाद पंकज सुरासुरवंदित दिव्यूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दिनीम भावाण सदा नरा गंगा तरंगरमणीयटाकलाप गौरी निरंतर विभूषित बाम भाग नारायणो प्रिय मनोंग मदापहारम वाराणसी पुरापति भज विश्वनाथ वागीशजुष्व वदने लक्ष्मीश च वक्षसे यस्ते हृदय संबीत निशिंगमहम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 
कृष्णोत्केतन गान नर्तन कला पथ जनी भ्राजिता सद्भक्ता बलि हंस चक्र मधुप सैनी विहार आस्पदम कर्णानंदी कल ध्वनिर्बहतु मे युवा मरु प्रांगणे श्री चैतन्य दया निधे तबल सद लीला सुधा सर्दुनी गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्रीशीला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी डॉक्टर भोपाल he was asked one day inside jagannath temple he was asked by some devotee why this kind of sculpture there in the wall so dirty this kind of in the wall of jagannath mandir some devotee asking to prabhupad the prabhupad why this kind of picture there in the jagannath temple all around very bad Papa speaking, it is very auspicious. How auspicious? Yes, very auspicious. Because those material people, out of their enjoying mood, coming to coming to check, coming to take darshan of Jagannath, they are deprived by this kind of picture. That's why it is the arrangement of Bhagwan. So in the wall of Jagannath Mandir, this kind of picture there, it is actually auspicious. Those who are busy with Jagat Darshan, those who are busy with material Darshan all the time, material Darshan, it is good for them. They can get busy with material Darshan. They need not see Jagannath because both at a time cannot go. Prakit and a Prakit Darshan. Together, parallel cannot go. Of prakito vastu ko bhun, nahi prakito ko chhod. In choitanu judo me do find, of prakito vastu ko bhu prakito ko chhod nahi. With this material light, if we like to see Bhagwan, Guru Vishnu, then we cannot see Guru Vishnu or Bhagwan. Not possible. material calculation material estimation a material vision we can try engage to watch but this way we can never get darshan of bhagwan because bhagwan is self manifesting object of prakrita vastu with material darshan it is not possible for us to take darshan of jagannath balaram subhadra radha rani Our Guru Vishnu Prabhupad Bhakti Mantra we cannot see. Material by material, by the help of material darshan we can get cheated. Papa speaking, those who are going to, those who are going to keep faith, strong faith, in their eyes, ear, nose, tongue, leg, hand, I mean they are full confidence. I can watch. You cannot watch because of prakriti vastu ko bhu prakriti ko channa hai. Those who are going to approach with the material brain, material leg, material sense organ, material, then they can get deprived of that. So, Baba speaking, all those pictures all around in Jagannath temple in grave is very good, very good because material people are challenging, challenging. Material people with challenging mood can come to Jagannath Mandir. Out of their money power, they can book nice hotel. They can do nice. Yes, this way they can enter into Jagannath Temple, and they can move around and look with his eyes. Ah, what is that? Very nice. After that, they can get deprived. When they can enter into Jagannath Temple, they can find Jagannath has no hand, leg, only round picture. This. This this way they can get deprived. They cannot see Jagannath. They can only see our idol. What is this? Go around. This can see. That's why Bhagwan, want Bhagwan want to cheat us. They have no hand, leg. What I can give to you? Better you can go to Kali, Durga. More practical. I cannot give you. See, I have no hand. To cheat us, Jagannath, 
purposely doing this kind of leela to cheat us. The same discussion took place long ago, I told, maybe 15 years before, in Vedanta discourse with Mahaprabhu and Sarva Mahatajajo also, every day going Jagannath. But he also believed Jagannath is impersonal Brahma, only oh, will. Same. But after now he is changed. Apanipad. Eh, Bhagavan has no hand, leg, everything. But Mahapu wanted to give argument, okay, Apanipad. But after their second line, Javano Grahita, it is written, Pashatiya Chakshu, Sinatiya Karno, everything there. Mahaprabhu wanted to say, Jagannath having hand, leg, everything, but aprakito, not like us, material darshan, you cannot see. Whom to blame? Whom to blame? Point is that, due to massive asasanga, every fraction of second asasanga is a must. So how to cut it? What is the procedure? How to develop that kind of vision power so that among all Maya, everything all around, I can cut Maya and see actual thing. This kind of power you will have to develop. If somebody going to say, if somebody going to say, in the ocean there is big wave, I cannot take bath. How oh, is big wave? Oh, wave. No, oh, it's dangerous. When the wave can stop, then I can go. Somebody speaking, nah? foolish. A big wave in the, in the ocean, I cannot. How I can take bath? Let the wave go. Let the wave go, then I can. But wave can never go away. Wave can never go away. The wave can stay there, and you can take bath. Wave can never stop. This way, Maya can always stay. But somehow you will have to develop this kind of vision power by the help of which you can cut all Maya by the power of Guru and you can see what is what. Long ago I told, maybe you forget, Guru Path Padma is a transcendental media or transparent media through which we can try to see what is what as our Prakriti. With his eyes, you like to see Make a CT kit or flight, everything. You can get cheated. You cannot see. This way we cannot see Radha Kun, Sam Kun, Giriraj, Maha, all these stone we can see. You cannot see. This is not the procedure. So, also song is the Maha. Also song can be there. We cannot say, I can clean all also song, I can kill everybody. Only some short people can stay on the world. How possible? Like Napoleon Bonaparte, you take and kill everybody. It's not possible. It's not possible. So, Prabhupada wanted to say, better you try, you try to rectify the whole world. How you can rectify? Infinity period, if you get your lifespan, if you try to each one, hey, try to rectify it, why not you rectify yourself? <laughs> Far better. You try to rectify yourself. You try to rectify everybody. Hey, rectify, rectify. How possible? So, it is a procedure if you can rectify yourself. It is the duty of Guru Vaishnav. They have taken responsibility. They can, through Harika, they can try something to change people. But if you try to change people, you cannot do. So, you can contaminate your heart by altercation, fighting. This only can go. You can lose everything. So this way, we'll have to develop this kind of technique. It is one kind of technique of bhajan. This is one kind of technique of bhajan. How to, how our Guru was saying, all bonded soul, but they are able to a nice bhajan. Ah, oh, whereas we cannot do. What is the technology they have? They have. That is the secret thing. Asadbhi saho sangastu na kartabhya kadachano. Asat bhi saho sangastu na kartabhya kadachana yasmad sarvartu hani adhapatascha jayati. Asat sangha anyhow, that is the key to enter, gate is closed. 
You have to get the key and open, and then you can enter into Gauriya Bhajan. Otherwise, close. You are outside Gauriya Bhajan. Oh, Dite Hove, Dite Hove, slogan. You are speaking, but you cannot get in. The key is that. Asasanga Tenge Vaishnava Chan. That is the fundamental thing. Most fundamental. Most fundamental. Where, where Srimad Bhagavad Gita is going to stop? From there, Gauriya Darshan starting. Follow. Where Bhagavad Gita, whole Bhagavad Gita, when going to stop? Then from there, our Gauriya Bhajan, Gauriya Darshan starting. Where our Gita going to stop? Gita, where are going to stop? Eh? Don't, nobody knows. Sarva dharman parityajya mamikam saradam vajya. Aham tvam sarva pape bhyo makshai swami masucha. This is the end point. That is the last advice of Krishna. Sarva dharman parityajya mamikam saradam vajya. Aham tvam sarva pape bhyo makshai swami masucha. And from there, Gauriya Vajan starting. And a gate can open. Saranagati, after that, then you can get it. Where Gita is going to end, then where Gauriya Darshan is starting. So, Asadvi Saho Sangvastu Na Kartavya Kadachan. It is not good to get the association of, of Asasanga. You are getting Asasanga all the time. Asasanga means those who are concentrating in material things. What do you mean by Asasanga? Asasanga is a vast chapter. But basically, Asasanga means those who are anyhow, anyhow, those who are going to concentrate in material thing matter, not concentrating in Chinmaya or Prakita. They are material Sangha. Money, position, everything all around, man, woman. They are busy, they are actually material man. In Chaitanya Chitamito, they are uh, three parts, we can say. Asasango. One is, one is those who are not devotees of Krishna, Jashish Sango. One is Jashish Sango, that is Asasango. Jashish Sango. And, the Joshi, and those who are doing Jashish Sango, one is first is Givata. Jasasango. Jashi Sango, first of all, those who are doing Jashi Sango, directly Jashi Sango. That is called Asasango. After that, second Asasango is those who are not directly doing Jashi Sango. Those who are not directly doing Jashi Sango, those who are not directly doing Jashi Sango, but Unknowingly, unknowingly, they are going to get the association of those who are Jashi Sangha. Those who are directly doing Jashi Sangha, with whom, if you are going to meet, that is also Asa Sangha. That is Jashi Sangha first, and those who are going to uh, get connection, I mean Sangha, with those men, they are not directly going to do Jashi Sangha. But they are doing association of such a man who is already doing this system. He is not directly doing. That is also contamination. And the third one is Krishna Avakta. That's well Krishna Avakta, non devotee. Krishna Avakta. That is Josit, I already told. Mani, position, Kamini, Kanja, whatever you are feeling, uh, watching with, with, watching with. Attractive mood, enjoying mood, that is Joshit for you. May come in Kanchan, whatever, man, woman, having. What is attractive for you? What is attractive for you? What you are thinking? Ah, I should enjoy. That is Joshit for you. Follow. This way, those who are directly doing Joshit Sangha and those who are having attraction for material things, ah, always money, position, they are doing. With them, those who are going to get association, they are also doing asasana. And those who are non-devotees of Krishna, those who are non-devotees, they are also. 
So, asasanga, anyhow, you cannot cut. So, better you try to rectify yourself, your darshan is very more practical. And the whole world, how we can rectify? This way, not possible. This way, Prabhupada used to say, it is my request to you all, better you try to rectify yourself, don't try to rectify others. Better you try to, if your eyes is rectified, you can watch all favorable, you can f find no, nothing negative, rectification many, if you can develop by Kuntha Darshan. Rectification many, if you are watching everywhere, no more problem, you say problem everywhere, no problem. By Kuntha Darshan. Negative Darshan is Maya Darshan. Mahaprabhu never wanted to teach us that you will have to insult Mataji. Mahaprabhu wanted to show this strict attitude so that at least they can understand something. If Mahaprabhu is going to make free the rules, hey, everyone, oh, Mahaprabhu told. Even Sahaja today, those Sahaja, they are speaking about Narayan, Narayani. You see the mood of Narayan. You see the mood of Sahajiyas. Narayani is the mother of Vindavan Das Chakur Mahasaya. He is the nice of Sivas Pandit. Narayani. That time Narayani was a four years boy, girl, so small boy. Mahaprabhu used to uh, do Sankirtan, everything there. Huh. That time. So Mahaprabhu one day gave Uchista prasadam, the Narayana you take. Narayana took and started crying. Prema developed. But the Saujiya, the Saujiyas, they are going to speak all of it. Oh, Mahaprabhu giving the small girl. So dirty attitude. So dirty there. Their heart is full of poison. Snack is more, far better than them. Poisonous snack is far better than them. They are going to the Mahaprabhu, uh, no, giving, you see, it, they make one issue. This is dangerous. That's why Mahaprabhu was all alone, very careful about dealing with Matajis. It is a strict rule. But otherwise people can do this way. Surely Mahaprabhu never wanted to approve Yoshi Sangha of Raya Ramananda. But Mahaprabhu, Supreme Lord, he understands Raya Ramananda is Aprakito. He has no idea about material ideas not there in him. This kind of bhav to grow, to grow this kind of bhav, it is very dangerous. How we can grow this kind of bhav? Somehow. Risha Singha Muni, Risha Singha Muni, in Mahabharat this topic some, Rish, Risha Singha Muni, Risha Singha Muni, who took birth from deer, but Rishi, he had no idea about who is man, who is man, we don't understand. But finally he was contaminated, purposely, by some group. Sukhdev Goswami anyway, he, up to final though, no, no contamination. Rishya Singha, contamination is still okay. Their contamination is nothing, they can, they have power. But bonded soul, if slight contamination, then get Rishya Singha Muni. So, Asa Sangha, Tagay Vaishnava Acha is a very, very vital thing. So, if we can do it, then we can enter into Aprakito Rasa Tattva. Otherwise, we cannot. We can get entry into a prakita rasa tattva this way. Otherwise, never we can. We can stay outside gate and give slogan. No entry. So surely Mahaprabhu never wanted to approve the, all the mischievous, dirty activity of Raya Ramananda. If Mahaprabhu understands there is dirty activity, Mahaprabhu can approve it. Even speaking, even I have sannyasi, I am no, that kind of adhikar I don't have. That kind of adhikar what Ramananda have, this adhikar I don't have. It's only Ramananda have. In, in written it is Chaitanya Jirdhamitra. 
Only Rayanamananda in the whole world creation. Ek, ek Bengali speaking. Ek Ramananda hai oicho dikar. Ek Ramananda hai oicho dikar. Sthir arsane sthir rahe oiche shakti kar. Kar, who has this kind of power? Who can freely talk with, you know, everybody and get developed develop that kind of power? Big problem. Whereas Mahaprabhu giving punishment to Chattva Haridas. Even not like to see his face. So we will have to think over and again. Why, what is the case with Rayanamananda? And what is the case with, you know, with that Chattva Haridas? Now we are going to enter into some Rasa Tattva, though we have no power, no idea, nothing, but still we are trying. But before explaining Hera Panchami, Hera Panchami is the date, try to remember. Hera Panchami is the date, Hera Panchami is the date, Ditya, Ditya is Ratha, Ratha Yatra is the date of Ditya. From Ditya, Titya, Chaturthi, Panchami. Follow? You don't have idea? What I can say? Like Ekadoshi, this, that, we are calculating, no? Dadoshi, Trayadoshi, Chaturdoshi. So you will have to grow this kind of idea. So Ditya means second uh, no, death of the man. So, Ditya first starting Yatra, Ditya, Ditya, Asar, Asar, in Asar mass, Asar, Asar, you know? Eh? Asar Sabon, you know? Are Boishak, Joshua, Asar Sabon, still today you have no idea about that. Asar mass. Asar, Ditya, then Rathi Yatra. And after Rathi Yatra, you will have to wait. Rathi Yatra, Jagannath going there. Then Ditya, Chaturthi Panchami. That is called Hera Panchami. Hera Panchami. Hera Panchami is a technical term. Hera, chan, Hera Panchami mean Hera Panchami mean to look. Hera means to see. Hera Panchami. I am in mean the fifth. I am in mean the Panchami. Who is going to see whom? That is we can discuss. That we can discuss. Hera Panchami is the date. Hera Panchami is the date between Ratha Yatra, Ratha Yatra date and the return Ratha Yatra. In between, Ratha Yatra date and re return Ratha Yatra date. In between, that the Hera Panchami is a big festival. So what do you mean by Hera Panchami? Hera Panchami mean, when Lakshmi Devi some darshanik vichar. Lakshmi Devi, Lakshmi Devi, Jagannath taking permission of Lakshmi Devi, Jagannath taking permission from Lakshmi Devi, I am going and I can come back very quickly, no problem. Going to Vrindavan. This way, Jagannath coming out and riding the chariot, uh, finally going to, uh, you know, Balagandi and there Gundicha Mandir. Uh, watching all around, you know, all around watching garden like Vrindavan, forest. So nice, Jagannath enjoying. But Lakshmi Devi, Lakshmi Devi become angry. Lakshmi Devi become angry because as per commitment, Jagannath coming back quickly. Why not coming? Who is going to stop Jagannath? Let me see. I am the richest of God is, you know, Lakshmi, my name. Who is going to stop my, you know, Prabhu? Let me see. Lakshmi become angry and to give punishment, those who are going to make this kind of problem, to, to stop Jagannath coming back, then Lakshmi Devi coming out of Jagannath temple in a planquin, all with, you know, maid servant going there to beat, you oh know, those who are going to stop Jagannath coming back. They are very sweet Leela. Very sweet Leela. But before discussing, we can discuss, before discussing, 
we should have some basic conception about what is called a prakita rasa. Before entering into this subject matter, at least we should have some basic conception about what is called a prakita rasa. That we should develop. Otherwise, we can confuse our material laws and prakita laws. That is not wanted. So, as per rasa tattva, it is written, Vatito bhavana vatmo, Vatito bhavana vatmo, Yas chamatkar bharbhu, Ridi satta jalevaram, Shaddate sa raso mataha. What speaking? What speaking? Ritin Bhatito Bhavana Bhatmu. Bhatito Bhavana Bhatmu Jus Chamatkar Bharvu. Ridi Satta Jalevaram Shaddati Sarasa Mataha. That is the definition of Aprakita Rasa. Bhatito Bhavana Bhatmu means when you can transcend the limit of your material conception. Your, you have some limit. You have some limit of your you have some limit of your material conception. Up to that far you can go. After that you are failure. You cannot go up to that. So you have some area of thinking. You have some certain area of thinking within this you know, area. You can think. But beyond that you cannot think. So definition of rasa given by Rupa Goswami Pad. Bhatito bhavana vatmo yas chamatkar bharbhu ridi satta jalivaram saddhate sa raso mata. When you can transcend the limit of the, like the rocket, you know, space shuttle, where fast, going to turn, going to cut the gravitational acceleration, then become free and go to, uh, can reach some certain specific orbit and then start moving. Right or not? Other than rocket, space shuttle, satellite with one rocket going. Oh, going to cut the gravitational forces and it is called escape velocity in physics. It's called except, ex, escape velocity calculation. So after ex, escape velocity given, that the rocket going to cut the gravitational uh, force acceleration. After cutting that area, is going to reach one free zone where he can move a particularly calculated orbit then this a satellite started orbit uh, running around the globe our earth and this way you are watching everything from satellite suppose you are from india want to watch olympic or something then what happens this happened no? there from here you can connect satellite and from there, live directly there, they can throw. They can take picture from here and throw here. This is a system, satellite system, this is. So, when, when you can cross over the limit of your material thinking power, then you can find another area, like the space shuttle, where you can, mind can enter into that area, but by personal effort, nobody, same thing. By Guru Vaishnav Kipa. He had to go, enter. That time, Bhati to Bhavana Bhattu, yes, Chamatkar. When you can transcend the limit of your material thinking power, you can buy excellent thing. Your heart become full of Suddha Sattva, bright. Your heart become illuminated with Suddha Sattik Bhav. Your heart become illuminated with Suddha Sattik. No condemnation. No smell of condom. All oh, Suddha so That time when you can cross over and reach that point when you, your heart is illuminated with Suddha Sati, brightness. That time you can get some time, that time you can get some special feeling. That time you can get some special feeling that is called rasa. Like in material world, when our sense organ come in contact with matter, we are enjoying? Yes or no? When our sensual organ coming in contact with some object, matter, then we are enjoying. Like your eyes like to see some beautiful lady. Then what happens? 
I was going there. Then I am getting. Suppose I like to hear something, material, and material thing. My ear going there, material sound coming. This way, whenever your sense organs, I mean any particular sense organ running towards this thing, eyes going, then you are getting enjoyment by watching one beautiful thing, nature, everything, contact with matter. This way, your ear, when you can come in contact with the material sound or anything, material song, then you can get enjoy. This way, each and every sense organ, when they are going to get their respective object of enjoyment, they are feeling enjoyment. But with this enjoying mood, but with this, but with this material enjoying mood, but with this material enjoying mood, we can never cross over the limit of thinking. They are all within this area of material. All within. You are in trap. Be careful, you are in trap of mind. Don't feel false. Oh, I am I know philosophy, I can speak. Oh, I'm big sadhu. Don't say. You are in the trap of Maya. When you can cut the trap of Maya, go out by the, then you can feel one enjoyment. Flowing one kind of enjoyment flowing inside heart. When your heart is full of brightness, illuminated totally. That is called rasa. That time you can get some feeling which is called rasa. Now I understand. Basic conception, what is wrong? So surely, all material rasa can never be compared with aprakitas. Material rasa can come. If you can come in contact with any material thing, any of your sense organ, whatever, whatever object you are going to admit, you can get respective enjoyment. Follow. But, a prakito ananda, a prakito rasa is far beyond. A prakito rasa where? A prakito rasa Mahaprabhu wanted to distribute to us. That was his fault. He wanted to distribute a prakito rasa. That was his fault. That's why we become so dirty. He wanted to give free of cost everything. Oh, prema. Rasa, but who is going to take? Nobody there, no candidate. So, now, Hera Panchami day, from morning time, a king, king going to arrange everything, because king is already there, in Purushottam Dham, king is already there. King is speaking, you should arrange Hera Panchami Utsav in such a, jag such a, you know, majestic way, big. So then Mahaprabhu, by watching this festival, become very happy. King is there, Mahaprabhu there. So king speaking, you will have to arrange the Hera Panchami in such a uh, big way, very, very enthusiastic, so that Mahaprabhu and his Parshat, they can enjoy very nice. So you have to arrange. So Mahaprabhu, so according to the desire of, you know, king, all big arrangement done. Hela Panchami. So the Mahaprabhu going to take the place in a proper place. Mahaprabhu, Sarup Gosai, eh? Sarup Gosai, Sarup Damodar, eh? everybody, Rai Ramananda, who not, Nityananda, Advaita Gosai, all there. They are all in group, Gauriya groups. They are going to, they are going to take one proper place from where the Hela Panchami festival is visible very clearly. They are going to take such position from there, Hera Panjami festival is visible very nicely. You have to arrange. So Mahaprabhu is going to sit there and all Sarvama, all every who not, everybody there. And uh, some Hera Panjami, actually Lakshmi Devi coming from the main temple. Lakshmi Devi taking initiative to come by riding a planquin with majestic arrangement. All Lakshmi Devi, no? Big arrangement. Oh, Lakshmi going. Uh, Lakshmi Devi sitting in the... And it will take time to come. So in the meantime, our Siman Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu discussing with Sarup Damodar, Sivas Pandit, everybody there, Nityananda, all there. 
and Mahaprabhu is sitting there discussing some point. Now Mahaprabhu wanted to hear something about Vrindavan beauties. So Sarup Gosai discussing. Sarup Gosai discussing about Vrindavan, so nice Vrindavan, all full of enjoyment, ananda, ananda chinmaya raso pratibhavitavi. All Gopikas and Krishnas, they are not, eh? Gopikas are not women. They are Sarup Shakti. So they are Bhagavan. Playing and Vrindavan, very solitary place, full of fruits and flowers. There is no enmity, nothing. Vrindavan, so nice. Even Vrindavan, inside Vrindavan, nobody is going to attack each other. They, eh, in Vrindavan, it is Riki. Vrindavan is naturally free of any. Vrindavan is free of any enmity. There is no, no animal, nobody, nobody going to attack each other. It's Aprakita Dhamma. Vrindavane naishargi ki durvaira saha sano ni migada yoho. Vrindavan is naturally free of any enmity fighting. Oh, naturally. Very nice, all around. Jamuna flowing, flower trees all around. All that's well, all nice. So, Mahaprabhu discussing, <coughs> and Sivas Pandit is there. Sivas Pandit is also there. When Swarup Gosai is going to discuss about the glorification of Sri Vrindavan, about Vrindavan, about Radharani, everything, then our Sivas Pandit is speaking. Well, our Lakshmi Devi, she is the goddess of riches, you know. Oh, she is very majestic arrangement. Your Radharani, nothing. No ornament, nothing, only flower and this, that. Only flower, only. see Lakshmi. <coughs> you can see Lakshmi. Full of appliances, oh, big. So, this is actually uh, first party, second party, to enjoy, nothing else, not fighting. So, Sivas Pandit is going to see, my Lakshmi, you see, majestic arrangement, oh, so much of fluence, you know, come, and you are rather, you know, only flower and fruits and flower, nothing. Then Mahaprabhu laughing, Sivas, you forget that in one corner of Bindavan, there is so treasure, they even hold your bacon to bacon, make summation, you cannot get. You forget Sivas. Mahaprabhu enjoying, Mahaprabhu speaking. Actually, you are Vaikuntha Parshat, Mahaprabhu speaking. Though I will have to clarify this point, Mahaprabhu speaking, you are from, you are Vaikuntha Parshat, ah, that's why you are going to glorify Lakshmi in RNF. But this Sarup, he is originally Brajavasi. Mahaprabhu speaking, this Sarup is originally Brajavasi. That's why he understands. What is the, what is the, you know, a big amount, infinite treasure in Vrindavan? Actually, Mahaprabhu wants to say, Vrindavan, Vrindavan, in one corner, whatever, you know, you can see, that you cannot find in Vaikuntha Jagat. But one point is that, but main point is that, Mahaprabhu speaking, in Vrindavan, there is Madhurjo is the predominating factor. Madhurjo means Madhurjo, sweetness. In Vrindavan, main thing is sweetness. So if there is appliances, then sweetness can come down. So all appliances, anything, all covered up. All appliances, anything, everything covered up by Aisharja is covered up by Madhurja. Aisharja is there. He means infinity. But still, that Aisharja, Mahaprabhu speaking, Aisharja is covered up by Madhurja. Like Mahaprabhu also have big appliances, like Krishna. Same. But still, Bhagavan Sri Krishna is Madhurja Pradhan, Audarja Vigraha. Madhurja Pradhan, Audarja Vigraha. Audarja means no? open heart, free. Audarja means broad heart, mercy distributing. Same thing. So Krishna is the sweetness, is the main thing of his lila, everything. But 
Audarjo is also there. But in Gauranga Lila, there is just opposite. Krishna is Madhurjo Pradhan Audarjo Lila, but here in Gauranga Lila, Gauranga Dev is Audarjo Pradhan. His heart is more big, going to call everybody, come, I can give everything. So, Gauranga, about Gauranga, it is written, Audarjo Pradhan Madhurjo Vikra. He also Madhurjo, but secretly. Krishna is there inside him. He is not going to prove that I am Krishna. That's why you cannot see. So Gaur Lila is excellent Lila. Gaur Lila is such a Lila, even it is impossible to find inside Vrindavan directly. Whatever happened, whatever Lila was there in, in Vrindavan, Radha, Govindo, that Lila also there. At the same time, Mahaprabhu going to express such bhava, which was not even found in Vrindavan. Mahaprabhu going to express such unique bhava, which was even not seen in Vrindavan. Excellent bhava. So, Mahaprabhu going to, uh, going to give answer to Sivas. Sivas, you forget. You are actually from... You are Vaikuntha Bharshat, so I am very much interested to glorify Vaikuntha. But he is originally from Vrindavan, Brajavasi. Saurabh Gosai is Brajavasi. But one point is very important. Saurabh Gosai physically never went to Vrindavan. Saurabh Gosai physically never went to Vrindavan. But he, Mahaprabhu Singh, is topmost Brajavasi. Hello. Prabhupada Saraswati Pad. Prabhupada Sarsipat never came in Navadiv Dham. Miracle. Prabhupada Sarsipat never came physically in Navadiv Dham. But he is writing everything about Gauranga. And Saurabh Gosai never went to Vrindavan. He is Vrindavan my mom. Now you should realize that Vrindavan is not such a place where physically we can go and contaminate that place by stool and urine. Vindavan is not such a place. So physically, Sarup Gosai never went to Vrindavan, but still Mahaprabhu speaking, Mahaprabhu speaking is a, is a topmost Vrajavasi. Ihanta Vrajavasi, Sarup Gosai is Vrajavasi, Lalita Sokhi. And Prabhupada Saraswati Bhava Tungo Vidya Saraswati. He is writing about Navadip Dham, Mahimam Ritham. Strange. He never came. He never saw Gaur Dham. He never physically came to Gaur Dham to watch what is good. But he is writing uh, Gaur Anga Dham Mahima. <laughs> Strange. So, you will have to realize that by eyes we cannot see Vrindavan, we cannot see Navadip. This is the evidence. Saru Gosai originally there in Mandavan. So, Mahaprabhu and Sar Mahaprabhu there in between, and Saru Gosai and Sivas Pandit discussion going on. Some other devotees also speaking something. Follow. In the meantime, suddenly Mahapra Mahaprabhu developing Radha Bhav. Suddenly, all on a sudden, Radha Bhav coming inside Radha. Radha Bhav coming suddenly, in course of discussion, Mahaprabhu developing Radha Bhav. Suddenly. When developing Radha Bhav, Saurabh Gosai immediately understand Mahaprabhu going to get this kind of Radha Bhav. Saurabh Gosai going to speak, uh, do song, kirtan nicely, and do sloka. Saurabh Gosai, also Ramananda, everybody there. And in the meantime, when Nityananda Prabhu is going to see, when Nityananda watching that Mahaprabhu developing Radha Bhav, when Nityananda Prabhu was there, when Nityananda Prabhu watching that Gauranga Mahaprabhu developing Radha Bhav, immediately Nityananda go away from there, gone away from that place. Follow. Whenever Nityananda Prabhu saw this, that Mahaprabhu, that Gauranga Mahaprabhu developing Radha Bhav, 
Then immediately Nityananda Balaram gone from there. Because it is cross it is cross connection of Rasa. His brother, na? Now Radharani Bhak developing. So now he is not going to stay near Gauranga. It is written. Immediately Nithyananda leave that place and go. But the Sahajiya going to make contamination. All hodgepodge. They are all hodgepodge. They are making all khichuri. Hodgepodge. So that get, so that they can get the advantage of money position. Here is the point. So this is main point. After that, Mahaprabhu watching. Now normally Mahaprabhu coming to a normal position. Now watching Lakshmi Devi coming in plank queen. In plank queen, Lakshmi Devi coming. After coming, Lakshmi Devi out of angry attitude, going to send some, some of his maid servant. Go and bind them and give punishment. Why they are going to check my Prabhu? Why they are not going to allow my Prabhu? He was supposed to return, not today. So there with, with some stick and everything, it is one kind of sweet lila. Then all the maid servant of, uh, of you know Lakshmi Devi, they are going to beat Panda. Hey, why you are going to? Then Panda, Panda, all Panda, because they are going to bring. Why you are going to check? Why you are going to stop our Prabhu to return? Huh? So they are giving. Beating and this panda also making sweet lila. They are rolling down on ground. You can, excuse me, excuse me. Uh, uh, today, today or uh, uh, within one or two days, I can send your prabhu to you. No problem. Don't give punishment. So they are binding the hand and leg of panda. They are beating and Mahaprabhu laughing very loudly. <laughs> this kind of sweet lila. Uh, Lakshmi sitting in the plank queen. Oh, Lord. Ma, Lakshmi Devi, you go, go, we can, we promise you, you can send our Prabhu Jagannath to you very shortly. You go. You can send? Surely? Yes, I can. Then again I can come and give, arrest you all. <laughs> this way, Lakshmi Devi, after giving punishment to them, Mahaprabhu and all his devotees laughing by watching this kind of mood, over, over smartness of, you know, this, you know, those maid servant, this way. Mahaprabhu laughing, enjoying this Vahera Panchami nicely. After that, Lakshmi Devi going back whole night. Because usually, usually this Hera Panchami happening night time. Most of the devotees, they have not seen. It is happening between 11, 12, 1 o'clock, night time, not day time. So, most of the devotees, they have not seen this Hera Panjami Usab. They have to stand there and watch. Every year, after Ratha Yatra, Hera Panjami, you can watch Hera Panjami, night time happening. And now, Lakshmi Devi, going back by getting the assurance from them, they can send Prabhu without any trouble, we can send you this way. So, this way, Hera Panjami Usab is over. Mahaprabhu taking all nice prasadam of Hera Panjami Usab, everything. Now, Mahaprabhu coming back to Gambira Mandir. Anyway, I can also touch one Leela of Gambira temple. And after that, I can go to discuss about Rupa Goswami also. So, now Ratsu Yatra festival is over. Now, Hera Panjami. Now, day by day, after Hera Panjami, someday our Return Rathi Yatra can happen. Return Rath can happen. So in the meantime, I already started with one sloka that you forget. That slok means, that slok is written that all Gauranga Mahaprabhu Parshad, Krishna, Kirtana, Gana, Nartana, Kala, Patho, Yani, Vrajita, all the parshad of Gauranga, they are absorbingly in some sweet rasa. All kirtan, ananda. Even in dream we cannot understand. We have tasted some little bit. When Gorang, we, we have said, our Guru Maharaj, Tittu Goswami Maharaj, that time, Santu Goswami we have seen, that time we have taken a little bit test. This test you can get only by the mercy of Guru Vaishnava. Well, enjoyment. 
What kind of enjoyment? Nobody knows. What kind of unknown enjoyment? Overflowing. Oh, with. You see, Tithu Goswami is there in the temple. Ratha Yatra. Follow. And after taking prasadam, the previous day, there, there are so many prasadam. We are taking prasadam and now going. Whole day no prasadam now. And going to enter into the cordon. Oh, so that experience is now. So much people, you can, they can make you pest. They can make you pest. Within that, how much power is to them? And are going inside. And doing Sankirtan, Nam, Ananda. That is, yeah, that days are gone. Those days are gone. We cannot bring back only money, 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 nothing. All gone. What is that enjoyment? Where is that enjoyment? So, now, all our devotees all around with Mahaprabhu, I already told, they can be compared with honeybees. I already told. They can be compared with honeybees. How? The lotus feet of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu can be compared with lotus flower. And they are going, honeybees are coming, taking the honey from the lotus feet. Ananda, they are enjoying. All honey come the, coming from the lotus feet. All honey coming from. So, Krishna Kirtana Gana Nartana Kala Pratho Jani Bhajita. Shad Bhakti Avali Hamsa Chakra Marubhu Madhupo. All devotees can be compared with Hamsa. Hamsa, you know? Swan. Hamsa Chakra Madhupo. Or Madhumakshi. They are hovering. They are all hovering around the lotus feet of Gauranga. And Hamsa, they are going to take the mineral. The inner portion of lotus flower, you know? Hangso what it is? Minal, minal. I mean the core portion. The core portion of lotus flower. They are eating. Very nice, tasty. So all devotees can be compared with all swan or honeybees. They are all enjoying whole day and night. Where from this kind of enjoy? So Krishna, Kirtana, Gana, Nartana, Paru. This way they are going to get enjoyment or all where from they are coming. So that the writer speaking, my tongue can be compared with the desert. My tongue can be compared to the desert. How I can speak about Gauranga? Sri Krishna Chaitanya, how I can my tongue is desert. <coughs> For infinity life, speaking of material thing, ba 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 material thing. Not enjoying the taste of Krishna Chaitanya Nam. Whole life, infinity life, we are taking the taste of material talkings. Not going to get even the taste of Krishna Chaitanya Nam. Whereas Bhakti Muttaku writing, Nautam Muttaku writing, you can feel just opposite. Nartha Muttaka is writing, Je Gaurange Nam Lai Tar Hai Pemo Dai. Nartha Muttaka is writing, those who are going to take the name of Gauranga, all prema can come. But we are not getting. Bhakti Muttaka is writing, that Gaur Nam Krishna Chaita, Gaur Nam Nam is that, that we can very shortly, we can get, by hearing, we can get prema, all same. So all devotees all around, Ratayatta going all, eating, sleeping, is not there. Eating and sleeping is not there, like our formula. Our formula is eating and sleeping. But they are enjoying whole day and night. But in between, I like to touch one nice Leela of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Gauranga Mahaprabhu, you know, whole day and night doing Nam, Sankit and everything. This is his reason for why he's coming. But Govindo, Govindo is not, you see, everybody going, but you cannot find the name of Govindo. Govindo is always busy with the Seva of Mahaprabhu. <coughs> he is less interested about anything. Govindo is only busy with Mahaprabhu Seva. Sometimes going, going with Mahaprabhu, 
Sometime going with Mahaprabhu, here and there, but all the time very alert. All the time very alert about Prabhu Seva. Hello. This way. So, Gorang Mahapu lying on the ground inside Gombira Castle. Gombira Mandir is big, and he is owned by Jan Kuti, Mahapu sleeping. And it is a rule that Govindo every day after Mahaprabhu taking prasadam, taking a, a rest, a little bit taking rest. That time it is the usual rule. It is the usual rule that Govindo going inside the bhajan kutir of Mahaprabhu and and giving message to Mahaprabhu. Giving message to Mahaprabhu. It is a rule. But that day, Mahaprabhu is sleeping in such a way that nobody can go enter into the room. Perhaps you have seen Jagannath temple, that temple, Gambira Mandi. You can see very small. A gate is small. Mahaprabhu is sleeping. So Govindu cannot go inside, cannot message the lotus feet of Mahaprabhu. Govindu upset. Govindu is thinking how to go. Then asking Mahaprabhu, Prabhu, Prabhu, Prabhu. You just give me side, I can go inside room. I can go inside room to do my nitya seva, daily seva. Mahaprabhu speaking, you can go or cannot go as you like, but I have no power to move my body. I cannot move my body. My body is very tired. Bhagavan is tired, you see. Mahaprabhu, I am very tired. I cannot move even my body. So you can come, cannot come, that's up to you. Ah, that's up to you. Through this Leela, Mahaprabhu wanted to prove one Siddhanta. He is Bhagavan. Bhagavan speaking, I cannot move. I am very tired. You can do your seva or not. Because Nitya seva cannot be stopped. Nitya seva. Nitya seva means Nitya Annik, Japa. You can live? No. Nitya seva means Nitya. Daily you will have to. No, there is no, you cannot stop. Nitya, Nam job, Annik, job, hearing Harikatha, all Nitya, it is called Nitya Seva. Those who are going to play their whimsical attitude, I can hear or I cannot hear, that's up to me. They are not doing Nitya Seva. They are deprived. Anyway, now Govindo, what going, what going to do? Govindo doing one thing. Govindo going to take one fresh cloth, very nice new cloth, and going to put on the body of Mahaprabhu and going to cross Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu is sleeping. Govindo putting one new cloth, Govindo putting one new cloth on the body of Mahaprabhu so that dust particle from the lake cannot go to Mahaprabhu and Govindo going to cross, jump and go that side. And going to message the lotus feet nicely. Nicely. Mahaprabhu speaking, Hey, go for prasadam. Uh, I cannot go because you are sleeping. Because it was rules. Then after Mahaprabhu taking prasadam, rest of the prasadam going to Haridas Chakur or Rup, whatever, and the, re and the residue actually who is Govindo taking. So now prasadam, prasadam is kept there, but Govindo now messaging the lake of Mahaprabhu, very nice lake, so big. In our new place, you have seen the photo? That's the original picture. Long ago, 20 years back, one, one Gauriya devotee who is serving inside Jagannath temple, Gauriya devotee. And Jagannath lotus feet is there, they are not going to allow anybody. I make some friendship with him and uh, give some pranam, okay, nice. He, I give some new cloth. I say, please, you put all chandan, whole chandan in the board, in the leg, because pin, put pin, na? all chandan there, that lotus. The chandan, I, I give a new cloth. I say, please, you get the impression of that leg and give to me. No, no, it's not the rule. It is not the rule. Like a, you are my friend, you know. You can bless me. You are serving this app. Uh, uh, please, you give me. Eh? This way, by the mercy of Gurudev, somehow he agree. 
He is not, never agree. Our, our Regu Prabhu wanted to get, but they are not giving. But somehow he was agree, and after that I give new cloth, full impression, that was kept for 20 years with me, very secretly. Finally, when the new place of Bengali center, then I give to one very nice artist who can art. I say, according to that, you will have to make. Very nicely well to do. He's very expert. He's making the lotus feet, big lotus feet. <laughs> this. Lotus feet, that I keep in a frame nicely. So this way, see Mahaprabhu, Govindu serving, after some time, hey, why you are not going to take prasadam? How I can go? You are sleeping here. How we can go? How you came? Similar way you can go? Mahaprabhu asking. Why you are not going to take prasadam? Now, uh, late. You are sleeping, I cannot go outside. Uh, how you came? Similar way you can go outside. But then, Govindu not giving any reply. Because this is called seva. Because when he came inside, that was the question of serving Mahaprabhu. That was the question of serving Mahaprabhu. Now, I can go to take prasadam from my belly. So, self-interest, so I cannot go. So, Govindu not going. This way, Govindu always alert, so alert, so alert, you cannot imagine. Lucky. So, all Gauriya devotees, they used to say, Govindu is second Sachima. Govindu less interested about it. Only is calculating about how to, how to serve Prabhu. How Prabhu can feel comfortable. Even Govindu going to chide, hey, now you go. At the time of Prasadam, Prabhu. Govindu has so power. Hey, now, no, no. Then if you start talking, Prabhu can uh, go on talking, cannot take Prasadam, Prabhu forget. Krishna, Krishna, Krishna Lila. No, now go. It's the time of Prasadam. This way, Govind was very punctual, very sincere, so lucky. We cannot imagine. Even Govind used to go with Mahaprabhu nearby, not do. Govind used to go here and suppose Prabhu going to Jagannath temple here, they are sometimes going. And sometimes not going because Seva is there. Prabhu can come back and take Seva. So to arrange everything. And whoever is going to bring whatever thing, going to hand over to Govind. Govind, this we bring. You take that. You can give to Prabhu. Eh? You can give to Prabhu. Where can we? There is all Ratha Yatra. When all devotees coming, from before Ratha Yatra, when they are coming, they are coming in all presentation. Some prasadam, every so nice, nice thing, preparation. Because throughout the year, throughout the year, Govindo giving this kind of sometimes sauce, sometimes these, that, so many things. They remember about the body of Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu always doing a Nam Sangha, not sleeping. There is uh, stomach become very hot. They are thinking. They are not thinking Bhagavan. A stomach of Mahaprabhu, uh, our Prabhu becomes strong. So, so we can make this preparation. This can help Mahaprabhu to cut hot. This way, all different preparation you can laugh. They're all making. The, some of them making mango, mango time. They're making dry mango, dry in sunlight. After that, they're putting in salt and oil, everything. All different kind of thousands of type of items devotees is doing according to their loveful mood to serve Prabhu. And Prabhu not taking. Prabhu has no time. Always busy with Sankhya. Now Govindu became angry and speaking to Prabhu. Every day devotee is speaking to me. You have given the item we bring from Mangala to Prabhu. I am speaking lie. What to speak? How long I can speak lie? You are not taking anything. Huh? They all devotees bring all nice, nice things from and here and there for your seva. You have given this item to Prabhu, my Prabhu. Well, I can try to give today. You are not taking. Then Prabhu began. Who is giving what thing? Bring now. Now Mahaprabhu with mood sitting. Hey, who is bringing what? Who is bringing what? You bring all. The all item, they, our Govinda bring. 
this this given by this given by raga this this who give this given by damanti this this given by you know malini this all speaking mahapo taking all jagannath after all take anything more no anything more na everything there that you can take uh, gradually because sauce everything is not a matter of uh, so jagannath every day gobind is speaking and not taking wonder hey bring whatever who have who is who has brought whatever thing they are bringing bring to me i am half of city like jagannath and taking taking all who is giving this who is giving that after that anything more like like that like that uh, you know giriraj govardhan puja annakut anything more you bring anything more no this jagannath taking everything so this way mahaprabhu giving enjoyment to all devotees and he also with all devotees all the time one day that is also actually happening but today i can touch this leela up and down something happening so what to do and uh, mahaprabhu go going to some place with gobindo and suddenly mahaprabhu hearing one song of git govindo git govindo after hearing mahaprabhu gone mad where from this song coming where from this song mahaprabhu running towards that source where from this song coming git govindo very famous song <coughs> very nice song <laughs> actually we have no right to sing this kind of song dheer samire jamuna tire basati bane banamali very nice song who is we have no right to sing i can sing but no right to sing dheer samire jamuna tire basati bane banamali very nice song. that song going on then suddenly mahapu hearing the song and running towards that source like mad oh who is going to sing this song i can embrace then govindo running prabhu 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 don't run no. prabhu is big long prabhu running like wind and govindo also super fast running prabhu stop 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 that woman 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 mata ji some mata ji immediately mahaprabhu stand and they were stand still mahaprabhu cannot move like 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 a pillar stand still gobindo speaking prabhu prabhu mata ji mata ji singing that song mata ji singing then mahaprabhu after hearing then stand still like statue cannot move up and down after that <coughs> after that somehow mahaprabhu going to come back to his normal position nan going to embrace gobindo today you are going to uh, you know protect my prestige i was supposed to lose my sanyas oh my god i was supposed to lose everything ha ah, you have done a great seva this way you will have to be very careful about me whenever i am running here and there you should be very careful so that i am not going to lose my sanyas govindo aji rakhile jibon quotation of mahaprabhu what mahaprabhu is speaking gobindo aji rakhila jibon you are going to protect my life i was supposed to lose everything i don't know i am running so mahaprabhu is speaking gobindo aji rakhila jibon stri parashoile hoy to moron suppose i am going to i don't know who is singing i am going to embrace big problem but that mahaprabhu you see that mahaprabhu same mahaprabhu try to think over and again that when mahaprabhu teaching what thing to us and why inside jagannath temple one day mahaprabhu with so much crowded so over population all people jostling and that mahaprabhu going to stand in the uh, in a uh, pillar there inside there that is called Uh, what is called? Oh yeah. Uh, 
Huh? Huh? Guru, Guru Stamba. Guru Stamba standing this way, watching Govind Jagannath with full enjoying mood and shedding tears. In the meantime, one tribal lady without understanding, she is very short figure. She says, Jagannath, I cannot see. How to see? Be crowded, I cannot see. Then she is going to climb the soldier of Mahaprabhu. <laughs> you understand? With, with the thumb, he is watching, placing the leg on the soldier of Mahaprabhu and watching Jagannath. When watching Jagannath, one Swarup Gosi discovered, Hey, what you are doing? Huh? Turn down. It's going to come down. Very heavy. Mahaprabhu, don't disturb her. Don't disturb her. She is watching Jagannath. This kind of, you know, this kind of loving mood, if I can get, I can become successful. You see the count. That Mahaprabhu, even speaking, don't touch, you don't see anything. Again, when Mahaprabhu watching this kind of mood of tremendous attraction for Jagannath, that the even tribal lady, very simple lady, old lady, very simple old lady, tribal lady, when going to climb on the, on the soldier of Mahaprabhu watching Jagannath. Ah, oh, so anand. When Sarup Gosai, all devotee, going to say, what you are doing? Mahaprabhu, don't disturb her. I like to develop this kind of that kind of loveful mood to watch Jagannath, to teach us. Same Mahaprabhu. Try to understand. Mahaprabhu can understand there is purity into, inside that old lady. Old lady. She, she likes to watch Jagannath like a mad. So let her see. Don't disturb. Let us see Jagannath. I like to develop this kind of mood of watching Jagannath. You see the teachings of Mahaprabhu. If you cannot Hear all this Leela under the guidance of pure Guru Vaishnava, you can misunderstand. Hey, right? right, Mahaprabhu, this just is done, this and down, this. what is a just? You cannot understand. This is a Leela. Anyway, today I am going to stop here. I can discuss tomorrow. Uh, Rathayatta festival, return festival, at the same time, what Rupa Goswami Pad road, about that I will have to discuss tomorrow. Krishna Kirtana Gana Nartana Kala Patho Jani Vrajita Shad Bhakta Valihansa Chakra Madhupo Seni Bihar Aspadam Karna Nandi Kalat Dhanir Bhautume Jeuha Maru Prangani Si Chaitanya Dhani Dheta Valasad Leela Sudha Sarduni Vanchakalpa Durusikipa Eva Chapatitanam Pavanam